Today I will share with you 3 amazing multi-image slideshows. Let's learn by following the video. Select the picture you want to edit. Resize it. Resize them to the same size. Arrange them in two columns. Duplicate Resize the first image to fit the page Move the first three images so that they line up in a row Go to Elements. Go to Shapes, choose the shape. Change its color to black. Resize it. Decrease the transparency to 50%. Go to Text, add new text, we enter Canvas Creations. Adjust line spacing. Move it. Resize it. Change the color to white. Go to position. Choose backward. Duplicate Resize this image to fit the page Move these two images up Copy this image and move it here Go to position. Choose backward. Repeat the previous operation. Drag the first page to the end. Click first page and go to timer edit timer type 3. Apply to all pages. Add transition match and move make the duration as you want. Apply between all pages. Here is the final result.
choose a background image. Set image as background. Go to edit photo. Prefer the old photo editor. Take me to the old editor. Go to edit image. Go to adjust. Increase saturation value to maximum. Increase the contrast value appropriately. Lower the brightness value. Increase the vignette value. Select a few pictures you want to edit. Click on the picture. Go to edit image. Go to shadows. Choose the glow. Adjustment parameters. Adjust the size value to the maximum. The transparency value is also adjusted to the maximum. Adjust the blur value to the minimum. Change the color to white. Move it. Click on the second image. Go to edit image. Go to shadows. Choose the glow. Adjustment parameters. Adjust the size value to the maximum. The transparency value is also adjusted to the maximum. Adjust the blur value to the minimum. Change the color to white. The same operation follows later. Lock background. Select and move them. Click on the picture. Go to edit image. Go to shadows. Choose the drop. Click on the second image. Go to edit image. Go to shadows. Choose the drop. The next step is the same operation. Go to position, layers, resize all images to the same size and move them. Place them right in the middle. Go to position. Layers. Click on each image to rotate it. Duplicate page. Click on the first page. Click on the top image. Go to animate. Choose the tumble. Delete the following pictures. Click on the second page. Go to position. Layers. Move the second image up. Go to animate. Choose the tumble. Delete the following pictures. Click on the third page. Go to position. Layers. After moving the second picture up, move the third picture up.
Go to animate. Choose the tumble. Delete the following pictures. Repeat the previous operation. Click first page and go to timer edit timer type 1. Apply to all pages. Add transition match and move make the duration as you want. Edit timer again type 1. Apply to all pages. Here is the final result. Today I'm going to show you how to create an animated slide effect in Canva. Go to videos. Open new video project. Change the background color. Go to elements. Go to frames. Choose this one. Resize it. Move to the top. Duplicate. Move a little to the lower left. Make the size larger. Duplicate again. Move down a little. Make the size larger. Duplicate. Move down a little. Make the size larger. Find some pictures and drag them into these frames one by one. Duplicate page. Starting from the second picture you just dragged in, Drag these pictures into these frames in turn. Duplicate page. Repeat the previous operation. Click on duration the timing icon. Set the timing to about 2.5 seconds. Apply to all pages. Add transition match and move. Drag the seconds to the maximum. Apply between all pages. Let's see how it goes. We can also add some text to them. Go to text. Add a heading. Enter the name of the first picture. Type Statue of Liberty. Make the letters uppercase. Change the font. Move to the lower right corner. Duplicate. Move up a little. Enter the name of the second picture. 
type Eiffel Tower. Make the size smaller. Move to the top. Copy this text from the first page to the second page. Move below. Make the size larger. Duplicate. Move up a little. Enter the name of the third picture. Type Sphinx. Make the size smaller. Move to the top. Copy this text from the second page to the third page. Repeat the previous operation. Now control the timing. Click on the text. Show timing. Shorten the time from the right until it is the same as the end of the page. The same operation is used on subsequent pages. Here is the final result.